five, four, three, two, one. Welcome to episode 104. 100, 100, 100, 104. 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. Plus, plus two, plus, plus two. It's four, 104. Yes. 104, 104, three digits, 104. <laughs> <laughs> Episode Ooh. 104. <laughs> 104. 104. Why we run away, start freaking this program from With sexual horse? harassment of whores. Because whore, what? Sexual, whores is not sexual harassment. No, whores is like a horse. Well, there's horse and then there's whores. <laughs> <laughs> what are we talking about? <laughs> what? I'm talking about black stallion horses. Horses. Like you will be saying with big ding-dongs. Yes. <laughs> horses do have big ding-dongs. And me and you talking about big horse. Yeah, like a big black horse. With big bush. <laughs> with a big bush, titties. Big bush capes. And big shatters. Ooh. Massive giant shatters. Hey, it is. What? You're beeping. <laughs> I can't believe that this thing's still alive. Your it's... thing just likes to be beep. beeping. Beep. Anyway, welcome everybody on YouTube. Welcome everybody on SoundCloud. SoundCloud. And that's, that's, it. that's it. Yeah. <laughs> just those two. Yeah. We're here. I'm we so... we here still. Yeah, talking. Talking like About crazy. Stuff. Yeah. And today news is. Ta -da. Ta -da. All right, so okay, okay. they found a famous YouTuber dead today. What? They what were, I missed? Fucking there was who this, died? So there was this famous YouTuber. Who? I think we talked about him before, who but I don't this remember. Guy? His YouTube name is Etika. Okay. Like how he look like? He's just like a normal nerdy brown guy. Etika oh. is his name. He is famous for making YouTube videos around Nintendo video games. Also, I don't know this guy. So he's like a video gamer, YouTuber, Nintendo guy. So what happened? Making Nintendo videos. Well, they found this guy dead. Uh oh. He went missing a week ago. Oh, somebody killed him. No, he went missing a week ago after posting a video discussing his suicidal thoughts. He was, oh, he was depressed? He was a sad panda, feeling very suicidal for some reason. He's making money playing you Nintendo games. No, but like, you don't understand. I understand this. Like, I even talked to Tia yesterday. I said, I have like crazy smooth. I like my life. I don't like my life. I like my life. And it's, you can't do nothing about it. It's unbelievable in your head. But like, what? Like, you know, you can't wait with yourself with But what shit. is there not to like? But no, that moment, you don't care about nothing and you just oh, fucking give up, fuck this shit. And that's it. Only one way is just jump somewhere. But that makes no sense. That's what I'm saying. That's what is unbalanced. But because. it's not unbalanced. You're just choosing those words. No, but I'm saying how I feel that moment. Inside, let's say I'm depressed and I'm like... Like... Like bad There's guy. a big difference between depressed and bored. Yeah, and between depressed and what? What do you between mean? Between depressed and bored and depressed and what? What you do you say, mean? Be, you say it's different between be depressed and bored. Bored. Yeah. And I said, you don't know how depression working. It's... Yeah, but you don't know either. Oh, man. That's the thing. I know. No one knows. I know, it's fucking, this thing, like, nothing makes you happy anymore. Even you have everything. Like I said today, like, a little example. I have fucking everything, and for a moment you're just sitting in the darkness, and good, this phone is fucking, so you're flipping the phone. Mm -hmm. Like, you're going this, 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 and you're just looking, and looking on the clock, go oh, fucking 50 years left, oh, fuck, yeah, it's coming. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, but like, like I said, I understand these people. I have up and down. I helping myself with any kind of pills. <laughs> yeah. Any kind of energy drinks and everything. And I feel like how my... Um, like like today I took the uh, uh, pink pill, which is caffeine pill. 
I was happy happy yeah. with three hours. Okay. And then it's crash coming. Okay. It's working complete opposite and you just reckon like, oh. mm -hmm. like that's what I'm saying. I understand the guy too. He have everything and for a moment he say, Ah oh, fuck this shit. I have everything. What I was like, oh, it's so boring and that's it, poof. He killed himself. Hmm. Hmm. Like like remember when we was on this big fucking here? Okay. What out if you have a big fucking what? You know the thing where I Hill? say, oh my god, we're gonna die if you jump. Oh, the cliff. Yeah. yeah. What happens if you, my brain switch say, ah, let's see you I'm jump. Yeah, but you won't. No, but like, I want to jump, see mm -hmm. what happened, how I gonna go but down. But you won't. How you know that? Because you know. No, but sometimes it's clicking to you and say, no, it doesn't. Oh, I can go over there and just jump and it's gonna be quick. No, you're just choosing to think that way. No, no, but like, probably that's what he did. That moment, he didn't care about nothing and say, "Ah, oh, fuck it, I'm gonna jump." And no. that's it. Well, how they find him? They found him. They found his belongings. Belongings? Oh, yeah, belongings like his backpack. Yes. With his probably phone and his other shit, whatever. And pitbull inside. And what? And pitbull inside. I tell people we gonna put pitbull in the backpack. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Keep talking about no one. Knows I who cares, about. you fucking yeah. retard. Come on. I know, but you should say yeah, yeah, and that's it. Continue. So anyway. Mm -hmm. So they found his stuff on the Manhattan Bridge, in New York. Oh, that's the famous. It's one bridge. of the big bridges that connects. Yes. Brooklyn. No, New Jersey with fucking New York City. No, it's right beside the Brooklyn Bridge. There's Brooklyn Bridge and Manhattan Bridge. Yeah, let's connect Manhattan to Brooklyn. No, Brooklyn Bridge connects Manhattan to Brooklyn. That's what I said. No. What I just said. You're saying Manhattan Bridge originally connects <laughs> to New Brooklyn. Jersey to yeah, yeah, Manhattan. Yeah, before, but now I said connecting to Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Yeah, but no, but Brooklyn Bridge is a different bridge, which is beside it. Oh my god. They have all bridges? Yes, there's a giant harbor. Okay, okay. Then you have Brooklyn Bridge. Okay, okay. And Manhattan Bridge. All right, fuck it. All bridges. So they find him on the bridge. Ah! Can he? Yeah, what? Not hanging. They just, he was just in the water. Oh, he jumped. He jumped off a bridge, yeah. See, I told you. He said, oh, fuck it. Let's see what's happened if I jump. How I fast I'm going to die. No, it's not. Let's see what happens. You know what's going to happen at that point. If you're choosing to do that. We'll it's not what is going to happen, because you already know what's going to happen. Yeah, that's true. When you jump off a bridge, you know what's going to happen. You have to be really fucked up jumping from the bridge. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I know. You have to be <laughs> fucked, like another level of fucked to something... take yourself to that point. Yeah, that's true. Because it's like, it's, I, it's, uh, no, like, I just, I'm fighting always the same thing. Like, well, life is only, you have one, so enjoy it. I don't know. This YouTuber guy was weird though. Yeah, but like. Because he was posting, yeah he posted like a picture of himself holding a gun online. Oh, here we go. Then, like, basically New York police raided his apartment because yes. they're like, oh, this guy's going to just shoot, shoot himself. himself. In the that head. was good. So they came in, raided but too him. too late. No. No, he went fucking to the bridge. Yeah, but that's weeks after. I'm talking about prior, before even doing this. That's what I'm saying. They should go into his house since they see like these pictures. Go help him. That's cry for that's help. That's what they tried to do. So what happened? Yeah, he jumped off a bridge. That's what happened. Well, that's what I just said. Holy shit, you're not saying that. You're saying the complete, like, no, I said backwards. They was too late because he jumped off the bridge. You're saying, no, he, they came over there because they see the guy. He I, he I saw that. Video, you know, you know, listen. listen to me today. No, you're not listening to me. I'm not listening to myself. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Okay. <laughs> so, okay, so the guy, poor guy, jump. Yeah. I can jump my numb nuts going. Yeah, your nuts will be numb standing on a cliff. And I'm like, Forget it. You're like, I'm not gonna jump. No jumping. No. I'm gonna walk down. You won't even jump off a diving board. <laughs> what diving too board? Too high for you. Which diving board? Any diving board. We wasn't diving board. No. I. When you jumped off a diving board last? I mean, I never was on diving board. Exactly. No, no, I was a diving board. When? Somewhere. 
<laughs> on the leaping special olympics yeah special olympics you right <laughs> with half diving boat the last time i jumped off something was a 15 foot cliff into a quarry oh yeah with camera in your hand yeah yeah we have we saw this one yeah amazing mm -hmm. yeah you wouldn't jump off that Yes, I do. No, you would have numb nuts. <laughs> no, different story if you jump into the water. It's a different story. Why? This bridge I, is over water. No, but like, if you, I, I set up my brain, I'm jumping, I'm jumping. Okay. But if you, I'm scared, you know, like I can, that's so dangerous, you can slip and you have no control, then my numb nuts come in. You have no control regardless. No, but here you have control. You're running, you're jumping, you go down, you, hey, you're swimming. Mm -hmm. And here you're just looking and whoa! And you ah, 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 oh my god, <laughs> where is my phone? Where's my balls? Oh, oh the nut nuts still hanging up there. Mm -hmm. I don't know, never heard of this guy in my life. No, but that's that's but... a story. Rest in peace. Yep, um, peace. And then in uh, Africa. Oh, fuck it. Good news in Africa. Which? South Africa or just Africa? No, Rwanda. <laughs> Rwanda? Yeah, Rwanda. Oh, Rwanda. Okay. Yeah, Rwanda. Yeah, Rwanda. That's an African country. That is an African country. Yeah, yes. yeah. They have nice... Nice uh, why? What uh, they got Rwanda nice? have like a <laughs> beautiful... Uh, they have very cold nights and very hot days. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Africa is ridiculous. Like fluctuate like okay. you have 40 plus okay and then it's like minus 10 in the night time hmm interesting it really what, what because i remember how it was soccer thing 2000 something mm -hmm. in africa and the people say how this game became nighttime everybody starts freezing over there well when they did the world cup there yes yeah it was winter time in africa. even winter time was there yeah yeah but it was so hot in the daytime People was with this big uh, babazooka. Yeah, Bo -bo 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 -bo. the babazookas. What yeah. they call this? Vuvuzelas. Vuvuzelas. And they say it was cold. They need blankets. And the daytime I was game was un unbelievable hot. And they couldn't even play. They play like uh, flies in the sauce. Flies in sauce. Yeah, like flying <laughs> in the sauce. Sus, yeah. And like, yeah. Try to get out. Yeah. And like, zig, 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 yeah. And then, yeah. And uh, cleaning the thing, oh, like, uh, like, Definitely a, like, your, a, like, your head is cut off right now. Oh my god, my head. head is cut off. Yeah. I have no head. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, like a beast in honey. Okay. Like, say the bee fucking fuck around the <laughs> life pot, uh, flying pot, and okay. she fucking land on honey. <laughs> on honey. Ah! And okay. you see this, mm -hmm. and she can't get out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's how they play soccer. That's how they, that was so hot. That was like they play soccer, hot in the mm. sauce. Well, in Africa, oh, kido, in Rwanda, in Rwanda, they grabbed five zoo-born eastern black rhinos from zoos from Europe and released them back into the wild in Africa. They took the babies from zoos. No, they were not babies. They were full-grown fucking rhinos. How old they was? Uh, full-grown fucking rhinos. Yeah, how old? I don't know. Like how two old? years old or something? What the fuck? I don't know. How is full fucking rhino? What? You never seen a rhino? No, no, in a zoo? I know, but like, a, so they grabbed the babies who never seen no, the fucking no wild. babies. Uh, anyway, full-grown no. rhinos. Okay, full-grown rhinos. Yeah, six of them. Five. You clearly don't have <laughs> one guy. Yeah. I didn't have six. I five know. of them. Anyway, so they released the five rhinos to Africa. Yes. And this rhino has no fucking idea what's going on. Yes. Because they was born in a zoo. zoo. Yeah. Why they do this shit to them? Uh, they don't understand they're going to die there? No, they understand the rhinos are going to die there. Yeah, because the rhino going to say, where the fuck is my food? Where's the guy who bring my food? Yeah. <laughs> they're going to wait to the day. Yeah. Well, apparently the zoo in Czech Republic... Oh, look at this big cat coming. Oh, was... What he want? <laughs> it's like lions eat him. Yeah. Because he's going to just stand in because in his zoo, his lion was friends right beside him. Yeah. Say, oh, look at this. It's, uh, what's his name? Simba. <laughs> just chilling. Yeah. What the, f what the fuck are you biting me for? <laughs> 
Yeah, see, that's crazy. That's stupid. Why they don't grab the orcas and relieve the Africa fucking desert? Why are you gonna put the orcas in a desert? I know, that's the same thing. What? Yeah, that's the crazy thing. Exactly, if you release the fucking fish to the desert. <laughs> that's no make sense. Grab the fucking rhino from captivity all life and release to the fucking... That's like, I, I get you and I say, hey, you know, you really come from forest. Go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but... <laughs> and you're gonna hear it. And Fuck yourself, start, you fucking <laughs> exactly. And I start walking in the forest. Yeah, and like... then the first thing, Grizzly gonna go and say, oh, fuck me, Cyrus. Yeah. Ah, oh, <laughs> whatever position you have to do. Yeah. So, in, they came from a zoo in Czech Republic. And this picture was all like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! They had that... to fly six thousand miles to Rwanda. They probably sick from the flying so far away. Yeah. No gravel or nothing. Nothing. Holy poop! They put them in this giant national park in Rwanda, and they're basically wild rhinos now. Five of them. They probably drink in a flock right now, together always. Kowalski, yeah. <laughs> I bet you all half of those rhinos don't even know each other. They know from Czechoslovakia. You don't know that. They grow up together. No, we don't know that. Oh, I know. What do you mean you know? Because they like... You talk to them? <laughs> no, they go on the train together. Yeah, Rwanda. on the train. Or plane, Even though whatever. they flew there. Yeah, but fucking then they have to move them on the train. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You, didn't, you never see Jurassic you Park. Did, you never see Drum, Dumbo in your movie. Dumbo. There's like circus and have a train and they have like rhinos. Over there. E, okay. Yeah. Or or even Indiana Jones, how he was escaping the, on the roof of the train. Okay. Because they have like some kind of crystal. Yeah. And it was rhino over there and you and you fucking put this his there was, horn fucking through the roof and the guys. Oh my god. There was a rhino in Indiana Jones? Yes, in the train. How they was chasing this kid who have some kind of something. Balls. And <laughs> they was jump on the moving train. And they was on the roof of the circus train. And oh. that's what was giraffe over there. Uh, okay. <laughs> what else was there? <laughs> Elephants, oh. monkeys, okay. bear. And then one... You know, they direct, they disturb this rhinosaur under me and he yeah. just freaking move his head and he said, like the roof. <laughs> mm -hmm. And the guy like, oh my God, like between his legs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah, and then he got real numb. Yeah, and that rhinosaur from, or else from Czechoslovakia. That was... <laughs> yeah. So anyway, that's the stupid thing. Like, why? These people are crazy, man. I was talking to the guy about this fish shit, you know, what we <laughs> <laughs> what we have here with this Canada and fucking Maryland fucking. Yeah, yeah. That's bullshit. They they right now are the fucking dolphins and orcas in the fucking captivity. Yeah. So I said fuck. I was talking with the people with it. People some some people say unbelievable. That fish was born here. Yeah. Leave him fucking he don't know nothing else. He is an aquarium. Poor people like working class people never go nowhere far away. At least they can come to Maryland and looking on some creatures where you're never going to fucking see it ever yeah. in real life. life. So it's good. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is going on with these people who release the fucking orca to the ocean? That's going to be the same shit like these rhinosaurs. It's going to be like, what? Look at this fucking aquarium so big. What are you going to do here? The only reason that law was passed because of one killer whale who was just fucking psychotic. No, that whale is crazy. Yeah, just one. No, but the lot are... One whale. No, but they said, if you they follow procedure, which is calf always stay with the mother forever, mm -hmm. don't separate them, then they never gonna go crazy. Mm -hmm. But they don't do it this. So fucking, if you keep it in captivity, calf, little baby with mom, you always leave them together forever. Mm -hmm. And that's it, let them swim. Yeah. Don't separate them because they get depressed and they end up on the bridge jumping. Jumping, yeah. Yeah, fucking. In this situation, they're jumping on a bridge. On a highway. 
Mm. See, but that's what I'm saying. Everything is depression. This I was listening to this last fucking thing with Joe Rogan. Of the, our guy was over there from the fucking uh, Maryland again, second time, third time. Yeah. So he said about Fourth this. Fourth time, fifth time. Yeah, but he was saying they're gonna pass this law, and they yeah. did, and everything working. And but he oh, said no. the same thing of, about this, how this. You can't separate the whales and everything. That's why they fucking get depressed. But now the whales can get separated because you're gonna throw them into the fucking ocean. No, they always in the, they always in the real life. The orcas, they're always in the packs. You see it. They never fucking one. Mm-hmm. The well too, blue wells, always in the families. And with woo and the <laughs> yeah. Anyway, they singing beautifully. They sing beautifully. Yeah, like like you know like 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 you pump balloon. Yeah. And you're like, <laughs> <laughs> they they sound like that. Mm. And okay, dolphins can sleep half a brain. Okay, so you sleep half a brain and then you sleep half a brain. So you always alerted with half a brain, but you can s- slip the half a brain off and that's it. That's amazing. I wish I sleep half a brain. Hmm. Like you, that's cool. And today they were showing they find this lobster split lobster. One on the five fifty million, which is one side is orange. Okay. One side is normal. Hmm. Very rare, the rarest is the split lobster. Then you have a blue lobster, it's one on 30 million. Yeah. And then you have orange and blue or rest. But yeah, that was that was big thing today. Split uh, split lo- lobster. Yes. Would you eat it? <laughs> what? What? One sec. Oh. What are you reading? Donald Trump tweet? No, that's uh... <laughs> See that that's the split lobster look like. Okay. It's half a orange, yeah, yeah, half a that's dead. A lobster, yeah. yeah. That's him. Wow. Look on the middle. Yeah. You have this orange and this is normal. Interesting. Interesting, yeah. The mulatto lobster. And then we have a blue lobster. Yeah, blue lobster, that's oh, the this thing. Guy have. <coughs> that's amazing how the they the people in interfering with fucking everything. Like, one group of people say, okay, we're gonna build a beautiful fucking facility. To so so take care of these animals. We're gonna, um, to educate people on these yeah, animals. Yeah, exactly. So the families can come see this thing. And this other thing. And say, then we're gonna give jobs. Them free. And then give jobs to marine biologists who dedicate their lives in school to study these animals. Yeah, so they come here in this beautiful facility and we have unbelievable machines with pumping fresh water mm-hmm. and they safe yeah nothing gonna fucking attack him yeah which this guy say was some kind of bullshit in maryland like they didn't take care of a lot of stuff like supposed to but why they didn't do it that's not animals fault that's management fault yeah that's and just... then they should fucking punish not the Ask people who want to see the fish, just punish these people who work there and fucking fire them and hire the right person who won't be there and help animals and, and everything. that's why the solution was just to release them and not have them, period, in the aquarium. Yeah, but why are you going to release them if they always born with them? Because there? the people were too stupid to take care of them. They're all fucking idiots. But why these people idiots? Because they don't know how to take care of these animals. Yeah, but why he hire people who don't know how to do it? And release the people like this Because guy. they think they know, but they don't. Yeah, but I think so they're skipping because it's so much. No. And they don't care. He said he put they put in a pen like 15 bears yeah. together. He said they're fucking ripping in a part that you got. Yeah. They know and the thing so was many. that trainer knew that it yeah. was happening and he did nothing about it. No, he so did. he's equally in the wrong. No. The only he did thing this. he's doing he... is just creating awareness. What's going on? Because over there? he got fired and lost his job. No, he went. He was. He said because he have this uh, walrus. Yeah, the bull, bullshit walrus. Yeah. This walrus born. Yeah. No, this walrus was born wild. His mom was killed, but he was like a little. And first thing he react was with him. Mm-hmm. So this walrus thinking that's his mom. And he, how he quit, he said he gonna 
privileged he can come and visit him. Yeah, they're all stupid. And then it's they say no. Simple. None no. of them knew how to take care of any no, of it. No, he was good. They I were met, all you met them. We you were was with us. him. I yeah, know. Yeah. But at the end of the day. That's Everyone didn't know what they were doing. No, no. You know what happened? Literally, one? Grant, that's like this. You know, you're doing your pizza, and I'm calling to you and say, uh, do it faster. And you say, no, I have to do it. No, no. I'm the boss. Fucking faster. But it's supposed to be. How long is this going to take me the pizza in the fucking hour making? But the thing is, I can't, uh, I can't do it faster. No, no. But I'm asking you, how much. A pizza in the oven is supposed to be. I don't know, like five, six minutes. Okay, I want in one minute. Okay. And you're gonna say no, it's not. Gonna yeah, be... no problem. N- no, no. Because I know how to do my job properly. No. Don't... I can make it in one minute. Okay, no I problem. want you. Okay, I want That's you. That's the problem. No. Those marine biologists and those people that were working there, fucking running around like they got dicks up their ass. No, because they, they didn't know what to do. No, the water was if you're, too salty. If you are good at your profession. You so. can literally make chicken shit into chicken salad. If you're good at your job, you can work with any tool to do your job properly, period. If you're bitching and complaining, making excuses that you can't do your job, then that means you're not good at your job. It's that simple. And the problem was with Marineland and the whales and everything, with keeping animals in captivity, is that... People working there, thinking they know what they're doing, don't know what they're doing. It's the same thing with the government in the U.S. It's a bunch of people who think they know what they're doing, but none of them have no idea what they're doing. And that's a big problem. All these companies are making jobs for people and giving them jobs that they don't know what they're doing. (coughs) And they're not showing them how to do it properly. It's either you know how to do it or you don't know how to do it. There's not, you kind of know how to do it. No, everything changing too fast. Yeah. It's either you know how to do it, or you fucking don't know how to do it. It's that simple. There's no middle. There's never a middle. I think it's different. You don't see different picture. I think it's coming from the top always. From people who don't know shit on the top. And they want cats and everything. And they shifting to your place. And then your boss try to figure out how fucking cutting shit off. Doing shorter, fucking faster, and not gonna be good if you start doing that shit. And that's what fucking affecting everything, everywhere. That's fucking politics. Like, you know, do it faster and fucking who cares? No, but my not. machine doesn't work. Uh, something is broken. The same in Maryland. He said, fucking the the machine who pumping salt and everything was pumping too much. They check water and they said it was too salty. That's okay, why... take more salt out of the machine. No, but well, mach- the you, guy who do it did improvise. No, but yes, they... you do. No, listen. Yeah, you let do. me finish. So he said he complained, but nobody fucking did nothing. And the animals go. That's what I'm saying. It's just a bunch of idiots that didn't know what they were doing. No, but he tr- don't blame him because I'm he... not blaming because him. I'm blaming the whole place in general. Yeah, that's true. Because Period. they was no care and who <laughs> punish. Who was suffering then? Animals, because fucking yeah. his fur was falling because off. Because at from the end of the day, it's because... a business. The end of the day, you're there to work and make money and go home. That's your job. No, I'm talking there about animals. Be... You separate personal from work. That's your always... work is not personal, and that's a big problem with people is they don't know how to separate. But they fall in. See, no, I disagree because. You should do it in life what you love to do. And that's you no know one. Yeah, you do in your life what you want to do. Yeah, so that guy was trainer and he loved doing this. But that's clearly he didn't love doing it because he fucking has nightmares from that job. Because this other because people... Because at the end of the day... He couldn't win he, with this idiot. Yeah, because yeah. he didn't like it. No, he didn't win with this idiot no. who didn't. Do proper jobs because in he, them, feed the water no, as possible. because if he would have loved his job, he would be working at another aquarium right now somewhere in the States. I think so if he worked somewhere No. He would, have, he would be working at another aquarium. What is holding him back? Nothing. Maybe he's so... He's, he, maybe he find out everywhere he work is the same bullshit. People know, listen, animals die. Then clearly you don't like your job. Remember how he cared... It's dolphin, that simple. Dolphin on his back... 
back to water because this dolphin wants yeah. suicide and jumping out. If no one knows what we're talking about, we're talking about yeah. this trainer who used to work at Marine Land who goes on Joe Rogan's podcast all yes. the time to talk about Marine Land. Which is on good. Joe Rogan's show, and we met the guy before a long, 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 long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Yeah. When they bring belugas from Russia. Yes. Mm, that is what you said. Yeah. So, I don't know. It's... I, that day, people think they like to do certain things, but at the end of the day, they don't. I can't say about him. You know I'm I mean? thinking this is because he give up with everywhere he going. That's what this problem. You can't treat animal like business. Yeah, but you know... No, you can't. You have what do you mean? The living creatures. It is. What, you have to invest love to them, and this is also is your job too. But but you can't separate after. Yes, you can. No, you can't think about business. this. Your walrus, who is saying he missing you. He don't know you work there. He missing you like a, like a family. So that's complete different story. It's unbelievable. You can't be just like. Yeah, but you don't, I don't know give how a shit the, about him no, anymore. He, you you can still care. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He was caring. But I'm and telling you right now, you have no idea what the fuck the walrus is thinking. It's a fucking walrus. How are you going to go in his brain and know what the fuck it's but thinking? But they test. You don't them, know what it's he, thinking. And this walrus you, was period, follow him no everywhere. No fucking human can tell you exactly what an animal is thinking. Because they are animals. There's a reason there's the word human. And the, there's a reason there's the word animal. It's a words to separate us. Uh, the, uh, animal trainer are talking to us. No, yeah, because yeah. that's there's a reason why humans <clears throat> are not considered animals because we're not. We're aware. Of... The humans is worse than animals, man. Yeah, you're the but same we're thing. separate. No, but you you tra trust me. I was in the army. Oh my god, fucking! You don't know whether you're gonna get it tomorrow from the other fucking people. Yeah. They so nice one day, one day they fucked up. Mm -hmm. Speaking of fucked up humans, in Nebraska, oh, ready to hear this? Oh my god, what the, what what happened before, uh, in the orange fucking president country? In Nebraska? Yeah, Nebraska. Nebraska. Nep, Nebraska. Nep, Nip, Nebraska? No, Nep. Like nipple, Nebraska? No, Neb. <laughs> Neb. Nep, Alaska. <laughs> Jesus, fucking spray everywhere. Ugh. Come on. Nebraska. Bless you. Okay. Yeah. These two sisters. Sisters? Now you say fucking, come on. I'm waiting now. Had a competition. Oh. <laughs> Who can have sex with dad? What? And then the one sister won by marrying the dad. Dad? And then she got arrested for marrying her dad. That's sick. Yep. How do you even do that? <laughs> How you can... Ooh. So there was a biological daughter yes. to the man. 100% his daughter. Yes. Then there was a half-sister. Which was not his daughter? Which is half. Yeah, but from mom's side or from his I side? I don't know what side, No, so to be honest. Okay. There's a half-sister, <clears throat> there's a biological... So which sister married? They decided to have this twisted competition. Yes. To see who could fuck dad, which is like the weirdest most fucked up they have to be on a, uh, some kind of drug i don't know this is nebraska this okay is... fucking welcome to nebraska land of the free you know yeah fucking... the, our fathers married daughters the one sister was 21 years old oh, poker the other sister was 17 years old oh my lord and the dad was 40 oh. and they... <laughs> okay so what happened so basically she ended up going to jail they both went to jail for incest charges because they got married. Okay, so all right, so that's it. Yeah, that's just oh, that, that's just waste of fucking our air on this news. Why? Well, because it's stupid. Okay, next one. It's real. Are you talking about fucking animal training? Stupid. Look at this. Is fucking stupid. Yeah. Father married. Father is stupid. The father Ma married, uh, married the, the daughter. Daughter is stupid, and another daughter is stupid. But my question is, where the fuck the mom go? Why is there no mom? <laughs> Did she fucking jump on the bridge? <laughs> <laughs> she went to Maryland, fucking. Yeah, jumped out with and the whale. And she said, "Can you release me free to the with, ocean too? To the ocean too? Yeah. And we have only train from Czechoslovakia with rain and stuff. Right. Going to Africa. <laughs> yeah. You wanna go? Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, I'll go on the yeah, African train. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah. All right. So what happened next? <laughs> fucking Jesus. Fuck. A man was accused 
Okay. <laughs> uh oh, something coming. He fucked giraffe in the airport. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't even imagine what this time. Sexual, probably something. I know you. Yeah. Fucking, I know. Okay, what now? He was accused of of fucking dis- his mother. Dismembering. <laughs> okay. A Tinder date. Dismembering? Yes. Like what does this mean? Like he chopped her on the pieces? pieces? Oh my god. This guy went on the Tinder app. He's like, this is a cute chick. Bitch was lying. She was 400 pounds. No, more. she met. <laughs> <laughs> I understand why he tried to be mad that moment. Yeah. I didn't read in detail why <laughs> he put her. in an action. Okay. Holy fuck. This See, guy... people, do not go on internet fucking love websites. Why? You could be fucking in pieces. <laughs> well, if you're going to match with this creep. Hey, this, listen. This tell guy... me a story about alpaca. <laughs> Everyone knows that story. Okay, keep going. So but, what uh, happened with this embering fucking chick? So the guy that? went on a date. Yeah. 24-year-old girl. Uh, oh, shit. Killed her. Cut her into pieces. Oh, my God. Okay. Don't know why. Okay. Don't know why. And then the court couldn't find out why. Because the guy, during the trials, basically slit his throat on the spot. And just killed himself. Oh, my God. So, clearly... Why are people killing themselves? Listen, this is an interesting world we live in. That's crazy. You have one life. What? No, the thing is, is like, what is the motive? That's crazy. Like, you match with a chick on Tinder. Yeah. So it's like a blind but date. See, in... It's a blind date. No, no, date. but wait. Ah, the... no. fuck, I'm talking. <laughs> and you're fucking interrupting me <laughs> like an asshole. I'm out. Oh, holy I'm shit. Out. I had such a good train of thought. Okay, going. keep going, keep going. Okay, so that's check. So what goes what through your head <laughs> when you when try... you're on this app and, and then you, you match fuck... with a girl. Yeah, and then you see the chick is four hundred pounds. No, okay. and then you're like, This chick is cute, I'm gonna go on a date with her. Yeah. You go on a date with her, and then you're just like, I'm just gonna cut her into pieces. I know what happened. What happened? She kept laughing at him. What do you he mean? said he working like say in a bakery. She said, "What are you so loser?" <laughs> bakery. No. Fuck me. This just bakery. Listen to me. I have also awesome thoughts, and you interrupting me like an asshole. Mm-hmm. I want to say something. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so she said to him, "You are a loser." And he said, "What?" <laughs> and she said, "Yeah. Why you even call me? Fucking, you're never gonna get me. You're never gonna get me." And he get her in the pieces. That makes no sense. That's what I'm saying. Because you this app, you don't meet. You have to talk to them to meet them. That's what you meet them after talking, and he say, "Oh my god!" And she start fucking see him in real life, and he fucking lose it. Hmm. This what you're saying makes no sense right now. Like a lobster. Like a lobster. Chop her on the pieces. The pieces. Chop, chop, chop. And then he say, "Fuck it." And then he realized <laughs> in states they give you fucking electric chair or something. So say fuck it, they're gonna kill myself faster. No, I don't think you get electric chair in Nebraska. No, they have fucking hanging or uh, uh, or fucking injection with. Uh, That's uh, not in every state. On Nebraska, with the father, mother, and daughter living in one family, <laughs> married each other. This is not from Nebraska, first of all. This <laughs> Tinder date. This from where? I don't know from where. Oh, now you say you don't know? I don't know from where. For sure they have a fucking. That's we find out. They are gonna fry him, and then fucking he said I gonna kill myself. That's but it. why not <clears throat> get fried? Because they said he even said that I hear still bitch talking about I'm loser and I gonna kill myself. Yeah, but this is just all assumptions. We don't know what Shumps- happened. Yeah, but. Why he killed himself? Uh, because Why he killed her? He knows he was... He murdered the chick? That's what I'm saying. And he's like, alright, I'm not getting out of this fucking shit. Maybe I'm he just... realized he heard the her parents was in the... Uh... No, you know what he was thinking? He's like, okay, I'm gonna go to jail. They're gonna ask me what I did. And they're gonna say I murdered my Tinder date. And then they're gonna... All the guys are gonna fuck me in the ass. Because okay. I'm a bitch killer. So, so why, now why dying? So it's better to kill yourself than get fucked in the ass and being the prison bitch for like 10, 15, 20 years. He could also ended up with life in prison, which is at that point 
killing yourself at all that point. Or fucking, like I say, uh, punished by death. In USA, is there all, almost every state have fucking this thing. No. <clears throat> yeah, if you kill somebody, you go to the thing. Only Canada is fucking crazy. We keep an all killers fucking one resort. No, we release killers. <clears throat> yeah, the same thing. The pedophile to the fucking uh, children garden fucking schools. Uh, yeah, I don't think we do that, yeah, but... But yeah, it's crazy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> pedophile fucking village. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fuck. The words, everybody live there. Mm-hmm. That's only one village have no internet. No internet? <laughs> oh. Yeah, fucking because they, they no allowed them have internet. Mm. But this guy decided to butcher his date. How old the guy was? Uh, I don't know. I know the what chick. What his name was? I know the chick was 24. Yeah, but what the name? I don't care about the name. Joe. Because they don't deserve to be fucking. Yeah, yeah, but they're again insane. Immortalized. But we, we still don't know what was the reason why he chipped. chipped the there probably there was no motive. He was probably yeah, just, but why he he was killed? probably a sick fuck like t- like uh, Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy had no motive when he was killing girls nonstop. Yeah, but no, put in pieces. He li- That's exactly what Ted Bundy was doing. I never watched this story, so I don't know. He was going to colleges, oh. getting shit face, and then murdering college girls on a daily basis. That's sick. That's bad. No, you should not touching people. And they're making movies about this guy. Why they? I'm nonstop. I'm pissed off on Hollywood. You know what I mean? It makes no sense. Because how I was little. Okay. We have us on Disney. We have a Donald Duck, okay. Mickey Mouse, yeah. Goofy, Pluto. Yes. Chipmunks. Sure. Fred Frinkston. All right. Keep Barney going. Barney Rubble. Yeah. Muppet Show. Sure. Awesome shows. Okay. What are you watching now? Fucking Ted Bundy on Netflix. <laughs> That's what kids are the, watching. What the fucking is mental everything now. Kids Every, are... Pro- they make this movie. The guy killed the fucking... On Tuesday. They make fucking... On Monday already movie about him. And oh my god. Let's watch it. What? This should be law. For all these crimes. No way we make movies. That was with Homolka here. And everything. The movie was made, but never was released in St. Yes, Catherine's and that's, everything. I know that, yes. Because families say, fuck this shit. You're not going to capitalize on this story. Yes. That's my kid die, and that's it. And I agree. There should be no fucking movies about Second War, First War, any kind of fucking violence movie. I want just fucking Mickey Mouse movie. Beautiful space movie. Mm-hmm. Fucking happy ending movie. I feel like you could have violent movies, but don't mm-hmm. don't do it based off real fucked up things that happen. But some people like really story. I hate really story. I always say I love Sylvester Stallone and Rambo. Mm-hmm. He killed five thousand people. Yeah, but he in... saw his hand. Yeah, and on the end he's happy and everybody happy. Yeah. Chuck Norris, the same thing. His show Texas Ranger yeah. was only based. Never bad guy win in this any episode. He said about this story. Okay. So every episode put away bad guy and never bad guy gonna win. Mm-hmm. And that's what he signed this show for Texas Ranger. And I watch every episode in Poland and here and fucking wherever. Yeah. But that's what I'm saying. I like like this movie. Hero win. That's it. No bad guy win. Look at Arnold Schwarzenegger and Commando. Yeah. 5,000 people in garden. And fucking, he saved his daughter. He saved the black chick. Mm-hmm. They are playing. They lied to this guy. I lied. Remember, I'm going to let you go. Mm-hmm. He said, yeah. So I lied. Ah. And she, he coming to the chick, to the car. And he uh, said, and she said, what is this guy? I let him go. Mm-hmm. And then they drive fucking. What's unbelievable movies. My fucking time was awesome. Now what do you have? Let me see the best movie you just see now. The best movie I just No, saw. just this time what you l- love maybe watching again. Thank you. Me. I can fucking start going. Rambo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That new Rambo is coming very good. Gonna be the mm. last Last, last blood. What? Yeah, something like this. It was first blood, now it's last blood. Mm-hmm. And uh, we have fucking Star Wars, fucking Rockies, 
creeds now creeds going down but fucking before was rockies and everything and expandables and uh, uh, jurassic park and awesome movies even uh, the galaxy thing garden of galaxy mm -hmm. was unbelievable hit yeah remember how we were surprised how this movie is good 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 and before you see it you say oh fuck that movies make very well yeah like I was surprised, like nobody <coughs> believed this shit. Even Iron Man, first Iron Man, mm -hmm. people said, oh, oh. and you see it and say, what the fuck? So good movie. And uh, now it's nothing. I don't know. Nothing, nothing. What do you have now, now, now? What do you have? Nothing. You can't even watch TV. I can't, I don't watch TV anymore. Mm -hmm. What is this on TV? Price is right, still. Yeah. <laughs> I watch this one. So that's it. Fucking nothing on TV. If you fucking Poly D in fucking from New Jersey, yeah, will be no do shows. We will be no nothing watching on them TV. And The Rock, no, maybe he makes some movies now. We have a Ballers. We have a show on uh, TV. I watched that. You never watched it yet. You should fucking watch it. It's a good show. And and that's it. Fuck nothing. Before we have Jersey Show or something, you know what's mm -hmm. this? Nothing. Jersey Shore was now they are putting the fucking new ever. show uh, called <coughs> Hills. Remember, we always watch Hills. How we was little with uh, Hills. Heidi and everybody inside the checks. Was that the OC? No, OC was OC and Hills was Hills. We have a Hills too, which was like fashion shit kinda. And was uh, hmm. now they are rebooting <coughs> with old people plus new people and okay. gonna be a good show. They were showing on TMZ yesterday. Interesting. Yeah, so that's good. <clears throat> Beverly Hills 902, that was a long time ago. But I tell you right now, movies like Over the Top are uh, Silver Stallone. Yeah, no one knows that movie. Everybody knows in my area. That yeah. was the biggest movie. Over the Top, Rocky Rambo from Sylvester Stallone. Mm -hmm. Schwarzenegger, Fucking Commando, mm -hmm. Predator, mm -hmm. and Twins. And twins, okay, <laughs> whatever, and Jingle Bell, whatever, yeah, yeah, <laughs> ET, that's no Star Wars, e fucking all big stuff in Europe. I oh, every year was something new coming, it was like big hits, and you're like, wow, you collect the fucking pictures from magazine, you put like an album, like I have a first uh, Star Wars movie, then was Imperium Count Attack. Then it was a lot of pictures, so you put like little because we have no this. You record this movie in a movie theater on microphone to your tape deck, so you can listen like a movie. You close eyes and you listen. And I remember I play this all the time at home. Then Cobra come with Sylvester Stallone. Holy fuck! This was Cobra, Robocop, mm -hmm. and Bloodsport with Jean Claude Van Damme. Mm -hmm. There was these three movies together invaded the game and it was unbelievable everybody wow then metallica 1980 fucking pop out with his albums one and everything everybody's what the fuck is this awesome band mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. master master get me plaster <laughs> and awesome what do you have now i want to go home i want i want to go home that's <laughs> ten man. Around the ground. <laughs> See? Fuck. See? Look at this. My life is, was awesome. Now nothing. Yeah, but see. And I'm depressed. This is the difference mm. because what you grew up with. Yes. Holy was, shit. David was, Bowie. Was a, Queen. Was a bunch of heavy metal. No, everything. Dark. No. Black. How black? Violent movies. What black movies? Violent. Well, how movies. violent? Rambo? Yeah. Rambo. So Every a... movie you named involves someone killing hundreds of people. Bad people. Yes. Bad people. Mm -hmm. Who won? That was the point. Everything in United States is good. Bad no have room. Mm -hmm. Bad guy. Mm -hmm. So are not fucking all bad people killing. Mm -hmm. Saving good people. Mm -hmm. So these people cheering. Every in everywhere is good with the evil. Good win. Hmm. Like goodwill. You know how bad will store. 
<laughs> you have goodwill because mm -hmm. people give. Okay. They don't take. They take like in. I don't know where we're going with this. I have no idea. I don't know. I get emotion because I w that that's internet ruining life. <laughs> Because now everything you can punch and it's there and it's so cheesy, it's ridiculous. Before you was waiting, like I said, was magazine coming or something, you know, you couldn't get even like Mr. Olympia and everything. Mm -hmm. Now like, nobody cares. Mm -hmm. Good as Joe Cutler now fucking gonna be ambassador over there, so he's gonna bring more people there. But let's September. Yeah. Wow. 28. Uh... <laughs> I don't know what happened. Why are you so sad now? Nothing. I'm just waiting to start the next uh, uh that fucking sexual fucking uh, no. a fucking uh... a Uber driver oh. tried to. Well, that's another fucking idiot. Tried fucking to business. kidnap exactly in state two, two chicks. Yeah, but like, the thing was, the guy wasn't an Uber driver. He just pretend he's Uber. No, driver? the chicks were just stupid. So this is the whole story. I read it. You listen, I, I, before you say something, can okay. I tell you how this works? They said now they want to change. The I literally Uber... have a really good friend who is an Uber driver. Yeah, but like... It shows me exactly how it works. No, no, but like... I And we I used wanna... Uber so much in I the know, States. but... I know. So convenient I know, easy. I know, but now... No, you don't know. No, because I listened to the program. It. No, I see... You've never used it. Yeah, but I hear the pro program. It doesn't matter what you What hear. they said, what they want to do now, because there's, there's so many violence. So how you going? You're going to have a green light mm -hmm. in, the, in, the, in the back window, so it's Uber light. So mm -hmm. they know that the car is from Uber. Because usually they have just sticker or something, you don't know. And yeah. usually... How I pull up to Walmart, people thinking I'm the Uber mm -hmm. because I'm slowing down on the bump, but the guy waiting said, You my Uber? I'm like, No. And I keep going. Mm -hmm. Be See, that's what the guy probably was. Psycho say, Yeah, I'm your Uber. Come no. in. What happened was okay, two it. checks. Two checks. Order an Uber. Or pick them up. Yeah. Then a guy pulls up in a car SUV. Yeah. And they know the guy. They know this guy, randomly. He just pulled up in an SUV. Okay. So they weren't thinking, and they just hopped in. Because they thought they saw an Uber sticker on his mirror. Yeah. See, but he never saying. had an Uber sticker on the mirror. So they just literally hopped in this SUV. Yeah, but you said you, they know this guy. Yeah, but they know this guy. From what? Exactly. I okay, think. anyway, so they know the guy. Okay. So the guy... Maybe he lied. So He's Uber when guy, you yeah. download Uber... Yeah, you have, you pay, you shit, you, you have pay paid. ahead yeah, of time, I know, and said. it downloads a fucking map and tells you what? how he's gonna drive to your destination. Yeah, see, yeah, yeah. And it saves I never drop, so you know, yeah, yeah. So these chicks just hop in, not paying attention. They realize that this guy is driving on a random dirt road somewhere. Oh my god! Then the chick in the front seat's like, "I'm gonna call nine one one on you. Of what the course. fuck are you doing?" Even though these Dumb you call run away. Chicks decided to hop in this random Doesn't car with matter. this random guy. He was probably like, "Oh, these chicks know me. I'm just gonna take them to my house and we'll just hang out." And now these chicks are freaking out. Like, where are we going on this dirt road? I'm gonna call nine one one. Yeah. So now the guy fucking grabs the phone, slams on the brakes. They all hop out of the car. He just throws the phone on the ground, and then he just drives away and goes home. And that's it. Jesus, nobody get hurt? No. Okay, good. Fuck Literally, it. they hopped into a random car. They know the guy. That they kind of know the guy. Then they freaking out. It's not Uber driver. And then they're freaking out. And that now they this don't know the random they... guy is yeah. not driving them to their destination. I know, I know. For so full, so guy, guy get panic too. Yeah, now the Why guy's freaking call, out. Why some... are you calling nine one one? Yeah, give me the fuck. Yeah, now yeah. this guy's in panic mode. Yeah, like, so what that's the fuck? good. That's actually good ending first time. Yeah, story. so it's nobody dead. Fifty fifty. They both stupid. <laughs> yeah, holy both shit. Both of them stupid. So next time, do not pick up chicks. If they're waiting for Uber. Yeah. You guys waiting for Uber? Okay, if you that's know, not me. Yeah, if Sorry. those... If you run into chicks you know. Yeah. And they're like, we already ordered Uber. Yeah. Tell them, all right, you're waiting for your fucking Uber. Because I'm not giving you a lift. 
Yeah, but like maybe he he maybe they didn't say it to him nothing. They just jumped. They literally and then just... they get panicked because it was like good road or something. And he said, clearly, well, maybe with let's go to my place. Clearly. I have iced tea. And they get no. We want to put. Clearly, they have dumb syndrome. <laughs> All right, next story. And finally, Beth Chapman. Do you remember who that is? <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Beth Chapman? Yeah. No idea who it is. She's the big titty wife on Dog the Bounty Hunter. Oh, shit. Yeah, I hear story. She's in the hospital with throat cancer. And she's like in a coma. She's in a coma. Oh. Uh, Dog the Bounty Hunter posted a picture today. Of all of her, she's in a coma, but she has all of her nails done. Yeah. And then he was making a joke saying, oh, you know how she is with her nails and they have to be done. But she was a big, big public figure. She was very nice. Actually. She was one of the yeah. most famous chicks on TV, hands down. Yeah, she was, we watched the show. With her on Dog yeah. the Bounty Hunter was hilarious yeah. and awesome to that watch. That was like 10 years ago. Yeah. And she's just in a coma and she has throat cancer. Yeah, terrible. And she's only 51 years old. Yeah, they said they was calling on two days ago to, uh, for choking. She couldn't breathe. Because... Her lungs were getting filled with fluid. Yeah, because it's thin, so they have to put... But anyways, very sad story. The, we want the Beth... woman was woman is very nice. We want Beth to survive. Yes. We want to see Dog the Bounty Hunter return. That would be the best. They do one more season. Yeah, they have the sun. They were on Hawaii, yeah? They're... Yeah, they were on Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. We remember it was the, the sun, sun, daughter, yeah. the bounty hunter. It was hunter. good family, fucking. Unbelievable. Well, best, one uh, of the best shows ever on TV. Back to the... Uh, yeah, maybe this... Let's pray for her and maybe this cancel go away. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, just sending... Praise over there. But good vibes. Good please. vibes. Yeah, exactly. Hopefully she makes it. Yeah. Do not go on the bridge. We don't need these big titties to die. We need the No, back. we don't care about titties. Uh, we will care about... She's somebody mom. She's yeah. somebody wife. She's awesome grandma. She's awesome... Yes. Uh, daughter. But uh, also... So, so... Ain't nothing wrong with watching big titty woman chase criminals down. Okay. No. That was the be best show. Everybody likes something, yeah. That was the best show ever. Yeah. No one saw you know tits that big. You know who ever disappeared? The guy, the, the uh, where we always watch too, the, the ex Terminator, the guy, which the I... Ricky, the guy who have like going to grab animals. Huh? Remember how he's sitting at home and he have like big Toyota <laughs> and it look like Tommy Lee from fucking Motley Crew. Okay. And, and he always go grab raccoons and everything with somebody else. Exterminator yard. guy. Yeah, yeah. Remember? No. Ricky. No. We have these shows. Exterminator. We always watch. No. He go to like somebody's house, rats, you have to take it up. Wasp. Remember how we get them wasps and other Nope. We always watch with me. I don't remember. Exterminator. I know Dog the Bounty Hunter. Yes. That's what I grew up on. Dave Chappelle show I grew up on. Yes. Exterminator. Family guy, South Park. And you're telling me I have shitty TV growing up. Okay. No, you was with me that moment. Okay. So that's still okay. And there was a bunch of Jerry Springer, Exterminator. Murray, Steve Wilkos, all those shows. But yeah. Yeah, but hopefully Beth gets better. We need them titties to rise. <laughs> Come make a comeback on TV. Yeah. Yeah, what the fuck are you looking up now? Exterminator. The show's almost over and you're going to start Googling shit? Uh, this is going to be tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, but I'm going to try, try to show you. Try, try, try. Show, show, show. Try, show. Yeah, try, try, try. Try, show. We have two minutes still, so it's okay. We have le like a minute. My head is scared of coming. What? Yep, maybe. Who knows? Jesus. Why are you put so close? Uh, it's always that close. You just decide the fucking... You're like, oh, I'm just going to start licking this table. <laughs> While we're talking. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I feel like I gotta take a piss. You got anything else to say? Or are we just ending? Uh, listen. No. I just want to tell you today. It's... Tuesday. Tuesday. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. But Summer. when you watch this, it's Friday. Summertime. Yeah. And... Good luck to our five rhinoceros. We, you know, 
Yeah, hopefully they survive in Donald Africa. Trump, uh, He's text, tweeting now. What is he saying now? Staff Sergeant Dave Bilalvi, today we honor your extraordinary courage, and we and it goes black. Okay. Okay. So, awesome. So, what he was talking about? Good luck to five rhinoceros from Czechoslovakia. <laughs> yeah, not good luck to Beth. Good luck to the rhinos. <laughs> Beth, come back to the life. Yes. Rest in peace, black guy from <laughs> the thing. From where? From playing games. Play what? Nintendo. <laughs> yeah, rest in peace, black <laughs> Nintendo man. And what else we were talking today? Yeah, we were talking about the sex competition. Oh, the sex the competition. Two, two Good sisters. luck to the two sisters with her father. Well, they're in jail, so it yeah, matter. yeah, yeah. Tender and day, they both end up dead. Yeah. You know? And and thank you to Ubers. Yeah. People. Yeah. With everybody was saving the story. Yes. Uber story, but nobody was from Uber. Yeah. And nobody was driving an Uber. It was an Uber story that had no to... Uber employees, cars, cars and anything. Cars, nothing in people, the story. But, but people but involved. It was an Uber story. Thanks to Uber, they have a good relationship. Shit. And then they find out the phone is fucked up. Yeah. They throw the phone. the phone. Everybody went separate ways. Yep. They now get raped. Yep. The guy um, not go to the jail. jail. And everyone was good. Fucking awesome. And, and that's it. And remember, raccoons have rabies. Oh, yeah. And that's what cookies crumble today <laughs> okay. in our story. Goodbye. Bye.